I'm Amy Pitter, President and CEO of the Mass Society of CPAs. And I'm Zach Dona, Deputy CEO at the Mass Society of CPAs. Mass CPAs is the local professional home of 11,500 members. As our community grows and evolves, so must the society. So in 2021, we sat with our board of directors and developed a strategic plan to guide our operations over the next four years. Now that we're more than halfway to our four-year plan, we wanted to highlight what we've accomplished and what you can expect from us going forward. Goal one is to be the professional home of choice for Massachusetts CPAs and professionals working in their firms, companies, and organizations. We continue to hear from members that we are more visible than ever before, and it's no wonder. To work toward goal one, we strengthened our committees, increasing participation by over 30% year over year. We successfully launched member networking nights across the state. We introduced CPA study groups so members can prepare for the exam together. We strengthened our partnership with similar professional associations to offer more cross-industry networking events. We recently launched an enterprise membership program to increase our commitment and value to our members in corporate finance and in advisory. Goal two is to increase the reach of our products and services. This area represents how we're helping members learn, develop their skills, and earn CPE credits. Our on-site customized CPE training has taken off, growing over 70% year over year. We have expanded our leadership program to include staff at all levels. Most recently, we launched a joint leadership certificate program with Suffolk University to equip new and soon-to-be partners with the skills they need to successfully lead their firms into the future. Goal three is to elevate the CPA brand by positioning CPAs as trusted experts, showcasing the society as the voice of reason and increasing awareness among students of the profession as a desirable career path. To build awareness among students and increase the pipeline, we've increased the number of student touch points by 60% leading to a 31% increase in Mass CPA student members. We continue to address barriers to entry by increasing our financial support through scholarships and innovation pathway programs. We've also worked to increase brand awareness more generally. We have seen a 211% increase in media coverage in the last year alone, elevating the CPA brand as a result. With insights from our members, we developed a survey to gauge out migration trends among high net worth individuals. The results shaped the conversation in the legislature around tax reform and expanded our presence in the media as thought leaders on the impacts of taxation. Our engagement on LinkedIn has grown by 53% and we've seen a 9% increase in followers across all social media platforms. Goal four is to lead the advancement of diversity, equity, and inclusion. This goal is spread across all departments of the society and impacts everything we do. Here are some highlights. In the last year, we've had more than 400 members complete DEI-specific training, so they have the resources and tools to attract diverse talent and build a bench of future leaders who reflect the markets in which they live and work. We launched a mentorship program to encourage, inspire, and empower future CPAs while providing an opportunity for members to give back to their profession. Our early college and innovation pathway programs are also expanding, doubling in size this year. These programs provide up to 12 college credits to high school students and introduce them to various career paths in accounting. We are also doubling our Accounting Career Exploratory Leadership Program, a free one-week non-residency program for underrepresented high school students who are interested in learning more about a career in accounting and business. Goal five is to ensure the society's operational excellence and long-term financial health. As many of you know, I'll be retiring as president and CEO of Mass CPAs at the end of 2023, and Zach Dona will take the helm in January 2024. As part of this planned leadership succession, the society is focused on growing our leadership bench by adding to our academic and career development government affairs and learning and development teams, and promoting other staff to position the society to thrive both now and in the future. Our strategic plan is a work in progress. We're proud of all that we've accomplished in the last two and a half years and recognize we are just scratching the surface. As we enter the second half of our strategic planning timeline, we will continue to visit with members across the state to discuss their unique needs and how the society can help. 
Your insights help us grow so we can continue to meet and exceed your needs. Our success is only possible because of the 11,500 members in our community, and we look forward to continuing to serve you in the years to come. We are proud to be your local professional home.